I'm sorry for, <laughs> for that caterpillar. Perhaps connected. It's never going to be a butterfly. It's quite interesting, this hornball theoretically okay. or possibly should just swallow the whole thing. But sometimes you get different ways that, that caterpillars or different insects as well try and avoid being eaten. Some of them have got spikes or spines on them, those sort of hairy protrusions. We saw that a while back with the hornbill as well. And it was dragging it through the sand to get rid of those irritational hairs on it. This might be a case of that caterpillar maybe secreting something. Maybe it's got lunch. something in the feces or some guys. kind of chemical that makes it taste bad. That's maybe why the hornbill is just... around ...getting the ends into the sand. Good coordination though, look at how it's neatly just moving its beak from one side to the other of the caterpillar. Sorry, this hornbill is a yellow billed hornbill, the, the species. It's about to be a very full yellow billed hornbill. There's another one coming in, this could get interesting. That's a bit of a bigger one. <laughs> Give me some of that. How do you want to do this? So I'm quite curious why it's taking so long for it to eat it. And those explanations I mentioned earlier are the only likely options. The caterpillars don't okay. actually have any bones or anything inside, so it's not like it needs to soften it up first. So maybe just building up the courage to eat that. That would be the equivalent of, of a very, very large one-piece meal for us. It's about the size of the, or the length of the hornbill's body, or the, the main part of the body of the hornbill. You can do it. Yeah, we don't have anybody to turn a bit. <laughs> now coordination is even more important. You don't want to drop that. The other hornbill is still waiting around. If that caterpillar drops to the ground, there might be a, a rush for it. I'm just choosing one. Here's the other one, instantly approaching there when the other one moved. Now... Where did he go? Let's try and see Alex here. Flew into the bushes there, but... Just to the side. Ooh, we should get nice and close if it doesn't fly away.
Tower yeah, of Attack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wonder is adamant that we don't see it eat the food. Get it over there, Alex. Well, I must say slowly but surely it is busy squashing up that caterpillar as well, just turning it into a bit more of a mush, maybe getting rid of all that liquid like I mentioned could be something foul tasting or maybe even slightly poisonous in there and now it's starting to look more and more like just a piece of food as opposed to a fat swollen caterpillar oh. hey breakfast that's very cool Always clean the beak afterwards, important to keep the hygiene up as well. This hornbill would be happy. Pick out one back. Morning. And if it doesn't find other food, it's got a fairly full belly now.